I've unplugged my controller. I am ready. Are you ready? I'm gonna hit the resume button and the game's gonna crash. Watch. Oh, I'm impressed. I am truly impressed. Okay, chat, who remembers what's going on? Anyone? The answer is... I am now currently underground. There is a bunch of ghosts. Wait, this ghost is small and different. She's tiny! What the fuck? Well, she's a healer ghost. So... All the other ghosts are the same, though. Yeah. Is she the only healer? I think so. This is ghost lead. And then there's the prison rivers up here. Who are on magic circle tiles, of course. So, I hope they don't move, but I also hope they do move. So, let's see. Yeah, they all have ghost as a passive, I know. Hmm. Let's see. So, you have spirit fast, of course, so you're gonna be very helpful for this mission. I wish I had the ability to convoy at the moment, though. Because... You have- you're running out of stuff. And... Oh, I just have a broken item in my inventory, huh? Okay. You're okay. For now. Kogasa has fast stuff. Biakadin does not matter. You're... okay. Hmm. What's in the convoy right now? Uh, blue fast, green fast, red large, spirit large, obsidian and stuff. So I have one spirit large I can give Suika. Um, let me see. Let me just take a look. Green fast is infinite. I would like to give it to Yiko. Yeah, let me do this. Um, convoy. Put the magic away. Take the blue fast. Take the green fast for infinite use. Yep, that's good. Pair it with Kyoko, and then Kyoko can move you. Convoy. Leave this. Leave this. And take the spirit large. And since you're the only one that uses larges anyway, take the red large and get rid of this. Okay, that's good. You can pair up with Nico. Let's see. Spirit has 20 HP. So, hold on, chat. Let me remember. Ghost? Ghost is permanent, right? Ghost will always activate. And it halves the damage that any character will take outside of spirit. So every single time I check damage calculations, I need to half it. So I just need to keep that in mind when I make my decisions here. So the first and obvious answer here is to attack this ghost. So let's see what I can do. That does 8 times 2, so that'll do 8. 8 damage. Kyoko will do... Five, so she'll do less. She won't do very much. Kyoko needs to finish the job. So the easiest way for Kyoko to finish the job is with... She can do one damage. How does rounding work? How does rounding an odd number work? Will that do three or two? Hmm. Komachi's fine on her own, really. Rounds up, so we'll do three. Okay, so what about Kogasa? Kogasa will do six. Or nothing. But. Four. Nine. So that'll do ten. 
10 on top of Ron's 8 will do... Okay, 18 total. Or I can do the blue homing, and that will do 7. 7-7. Seven, seven. Let's do this. I have my plan. Okay. So then Kogasa will move up here. Kogasa will initiate a fight with this one. And that'll do... This should do 10. Okay. And then Kyoko will come up here and she will do... I was incorrect on my math. Problem has arisen. I thought I would have one more damage. Huh. Magic is not blocked by ghost. I remember that. So... Spirit homing. That'll do four. That'll do three times two. I don't want to kill her. I want to weaken her. Magic is not blocked. I don't have a way to do this, I don't think. Unless Miko can do something. Oh, she kills it. Hmm... Well, this is a bit of a predicament. I guess I'll just switch to, uh... Yeah, Yuko and finish it off with that. My numbers were incorrect. That's unfortunate. Okay, let's see what's going on. I'm gonna put Komachi in the tree and wait. Trinity up. Let's see. In the forest. Wait there. The Akadem will at least do some damage. So there's that. Put that there. Put the Akadem here. I'm gonna separate. Like that. Hmm. And that'll just instantly kill. Okay. And that doesn't do any damage at all. Eight. Alright. Vantage is always good. Hmm. Okay, so they're not gonna rush me. So let's take a look at the board now. What is happening on the board. Interesting that these two didn't bother coming down here to fight. Alright, Kamachi. That'll hurt. Bye bye, little one. That takes care of that. And you have 12 HP left. So, if I attack you, I'll take you down to 4 again. And that's not enough for Kyoko to get a kill. This will take you down to 4 as well. Uh, that'll... That'll kill you. This is so hard! I'm trying to figure out a way to hit this ghost without killing it so Kyoko can finish it. Uh, that will do six, so that won't be enough. And that will do eight, which again, will be enough. And you do too much damage. Hmm. Uh, that does... 19 half, so that's gonna do about nine. Ah, yeah, fuck it, hit her. Okay, it does ten. That's enough for Kyoko. All right, get in there, good morning, crew. That'll kill her. 
That will also kill her, actually. Yes, my math is correct. And has Beast as well. So move Kyoko over here in their strike zone. You have 12 HP. This will do... That'll do 4. That will do 10. 10 damage. 10 damage. 10 damage. 10 damage. 10 damage. This will do 8. Fuck it, why not? Okay. And that lets Kogasa finish the job with a blue fast. Very good. Very good. And then there's a ghost here. I don't really care for giving Miko stuff. I guess I'll keep Ron in close proximity. Suika's in the tree. Maybe I should move... I'm gonna move Biakuden closer to, uh... Closer over here to get the Komachi. And then, well... Miko's our own beast who doesn't really need to do anything. And the fairies... I'll put them over here. Alright, see what happens. It's fine. That's fine. Ikari is not a great unit, huh? One. Hmm. Hmm. More guests? Anyone super welcome to our concerts? Let's show them what we can do and turn it up a notch. Wow, wow! The music's picking up. Ow, my ears hurt. This is bad. The music is affecting the vengeful spirits. We can't afford to take this slowly. Everyone move fast. The level of all spirits has increased. Oh, I see! So there... Therein lies the issue, huh? Okay. That's not gonna hit. Oh, critical! Nice. It's a pretty good level up, actually. As is that. Okay, Komachi's in a bit of danger. Let's see what I can do to get this thing off the magical circle. Green homing or blue homing? Let's go blue homing. Ron is a little bit, uh, good. Can't move her very far, though. But, it's alright. I'm gonna keep her in place. And, I'll have Suika. I'm here and whack you. That'll do... How much will that do? 8. 11. That'll do 8. Magic may be weak, but it isn't blocked. Oh, that was unnecessary. <laughs> Zero times two, three times two. With no real chance of actually hitting. It's fine. Give it a shot, why not? Okay. And you are here at the moment. That'll do... Six. That'll do... Four. That'll do a lot. And that'll do six. That'll do one. Alright, Miko. Get up there and get ready to fight. Oh, that's one of the healer ones. Okay. That one can still hurt me, though. Um, 
Yeah, why not? Oh, that works too. You can't predict criticals. Oh, that's not good. Well, that'll work out if both of these hit, though. Come on, Kogasa. Hit a thunder. Good job. Well done. So what's left to do here? Just Komachi, really. How much does this one do to Komachi? We'll do 10. And that's obviously a problem if it retaliates, so... Let's see, what about you guys? I'm gonna put you here. And see what happens. Okay, she came out of the circle, so her stats won't be as good. Wait. Komachi might have just died, unless she gets an upgrade to block whatever's coming from that other one up there. Ah! That's not good. That will kill me. No, it won't. That... That one ran away to use a Volinary because it got 1 HP on a level up. Great. <laughs> Pickle. Pickle. Hmm. Can't move close enough to get to this one. When the when the prison members do their song, they don't actually level themselves up, do they? Hmm. Oh gosh, I can't reach from there. It's fine. To be honest, I'd rather put Miko up here and start dealing with this. So. Miko is, like, kind of ridiculous, so I don't have to worry too much about her. But if I need to make progress, then I can just throw her at it and just watch as magic happens, I suppose. Sleeper can't move. Omachi needs to not move. It's fine, we're in the tree. Uh-huh. Put the fairies away with their magic. And then I'm going to put Ron in the tree. Nice. I'm a little bit worried about how much time I really have to do this. And Yukari is... Yukari's fine. She's not really doing anything anyway, so she can just wait. Okay, so that one is dead set on doing that. Nah, that's fine too. The fast ones... Oh, a double, wow. Yukari has a lot of skill, so she has crit chances, but that's about it. I mean, she's faster than the spirit, so that's nice. The levels are so skewed though, like... My, the characters I've had since the first map are in level 10 range, and then I got Komachi and she's level 1. Kogasa and Kyoko also start at level 1, so it's like, Jesus. I'm just glad Miko's doing her job, but really. <laughs> Sit back and watch the show. I kind of hope this misses so Kyoko can finish her. Well, it's all right. All right, there's the save prompt. Overwrite file one. Woohoo, I'm really feeling it now. Wow, Merlin's really going all out. Come on, Lunas, let's do the same. Maintaining a harmony is paramount in music, but passion is important too. All right, keep on enjoying our performance. 
What? They still got more in them? They're not the only ones. The spirits are getting stronger. At this rate... Uh, it's getting a bit dangerous. Put Komachi back up. That one's gone. That one is 24 HP. Put Komachi in the forest. Kick her ass! Go, Sonny, go! Alright, that's good. And up over here. Can you kill this one with your attack? I won't do enough damage. One of these needs to hit. Well done! Wait! I rounded down! Never mind, Kyoko's really good. She did her best. And I guess I'll just put Ron in the tree, really. Let's keep things moving. Um, I'm gonna move Kogas over here and give her this free kill. Good. That's, well, that's fine. And she got another fast upgrade at least. Um, no, actually, I'm gonna move Suika up here to draw in some attention. And... Yukari will do this to kill this one. Nice. Give me a speed and a strength. Uh... See, I can't call that a bad level up, but I would really like some more strength. I would like to do more damage. Alright, you need to die now. Alright, that does enough too. Excellent. So, does anyone know how high the levels can go for the spirits? Do the prison members cap out after a certain point, or are they just gonna keep doing it until it's like impossible for me to win? I, I think I'm fine. But, like, I'm curious to how high that can go before the game's just like, Alright, what are you doing? Why did you do that? Alright, the Miko Blender has succeeded in its mission. <laughs> oh my god! He didn't even die. Hmm. Can't fire me XP. Heal Komachi. Um, Komachi. Can you hit her? You don't have a very good chance of hitting her. Fuck yeah, you're the best. I knew I could count on you. All right. Green ghost up here. All right, Ron, do uh, do the thing that you're good at doing, which is hitting twice and not actually taking any damage back. <laughs> Dude, why is she so good? Her her gross are insane. Yeah, go up in the tree. Hang out in the tree. Blue fast. That's where Suiko comes into play and cleaves you in two. Yep. Five damage, good. That should be enough for Kogasa to swoop in here and finish the job. Hell yeah it is! Get her! Go, my little umbrella! Yo, he doesn't even get EXP. <laughs> Alright. You're up here. And... You're over here. Are we good? Has everyone moved? Oh no, Kyoko hasn't moved yet. Can you do this job, Kyoko? Hmm. Can you handle this?
Okay. Their lineup isn't moving from the front. I don't really know why, though. This should be fine. Chat, whenever I look at a Fire Emblem map, there always feels like there's more enemies than there actually is. Either that or you just cleave through a lot of them decently fast. I don't know why you attacked Ron, but whatever. She doesn't even get any EXP for it anymore. <laughs> well, she does, but it's starting to really dip. And then Yukari should get a free kill here. Oh, definitely a free kill. What? You can't miss critical hits! She did it again anyways! Cool. Cool. Y okay, sure. Time for the main event. Merlin and I matching our wavelengths. Better keep up, sis. One, two, oh! And then the levels go up again. Hell yeah! Looks like our side is getting affected too. These girls are more dangerous than we expected. Man, I'm really pumped up all of a sudden. Try not to get swept up in the atmosphere. If you let your guard down, you'll come back here the hard way. I'm sorry before it's too late. Everything has increased its level again. Miko is still perfectly fine though. Down you go. Crits aren't supposed to miss because crits crits mean that you actually landed the attack. So they aren't <laughs> they're not fucking supposed to miss. Am I not in range? No, I'm really not, huh? Okay. Let's see. Hmm. I could put Kogasa in the tree and see what happens. Hmm. Can't do much of a wait, so I'll just drink a bowl and there. Let's see. I kind of want to just put her in the tree. <laughs> do your best. Tree buddies. Alright, let's see. Hmm. The trees give a- yeah, there's a bonus up there you can see. It gives plus one to defense and plus 15 to avoid. Nice. Let me see, before I put Komachi in harm's way... That is not enough damage to deal with this one. Chip damage. She has a ranged one too, though, so. Uh. That's fine there, then. I'm gonna pair those two, so there's a little more defense on that. Let's see what happens. Oh. Okay. Okay! That's fine. There's only so many of them left. Backfire? What the fuck does that do? Okay. <laughs> She's fine. And she always gets the first hit. Oh, 
Oh, that did damage though. And this is well, this part, this side of the map doesn't even really matter. Okay, I'm assuming her luck stat is capped out, and that's why I didn't go any higher than 20. And a crit. <laughs> Still alive, though. Alright. And this should just kill it. Yep. Now, what was that skill that one had? Backfire. Which one was... did that? Um... I don't know which one did that, chat. The dark large one. This one? They all have ghosts. I don't see backfire on them. Nope. 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 I don't see it. The one that attacks Sika, but I don't see it. None of them have it. They all have ghosts. None of them have whatever backfire is. Oh, it's the weapon. Large shot dot mock was Black Knight. I'm unlucky. If unlucky hurts the user instead of the enemy. Oh, I see. So she hit herself. Think fast! The devil weapon, yeah. That's a terrible level. Why did you get the good level? Who wants to do the damage here? Luna, uh, yeah, do your thing. Lightning bolt. Okay, good. That'll do 10. Okay, that does 10. That only does two though. Oh, actually it only does one. This one's a problem. I guess I'll just pick on it for a little bit. Hmm. Alright. I can't even call that bad. Her speed and defense are ridiculously high at this point in the game. Um. I'm worried about taking Kyoko out of the tree is the problem. Because this one gets a free hit. 10, 10 damage. 8 damage. Yeah, I don't really want to take Kyoko out of the tree. So what's happening down here? Well, what's happening right now is Yukari is coming over here. She's sitting in the tree. And she is going to throw spirit homing. It's what she would do if I wasn't scared of getting retaliated on. Hold that thought. Hmm. That's not what I want to have happen at all. This might work better. Now that is what you like to see. Bye bye. Let's see. So there's four left here. Yeah, that one can do a lot of damage if it hits me. So let's hit her first. <laughs> cool. 
That sounds that seems like a fun thing to play with. Alright, Kogasa, they don't do any damage to you. I'm scared that Merlin's gonna come out of there and hit me though. Fuck it, you got this, you're the best. You're the umbrella that could! Um, is anyone left to move? Who can still move? Oh, right, you. Mm. The prison members don't move, that's good. It is now time for Pogasa to become the strong. I don't want you to die. Oh, that, now you definitely won't die. It's fine. <laughs> oh. It's not fair. She tries so hard and she gets nothing for it. Oh, that one's slowly approaching. And this one has decided to die. Okay, let's figure out what's going on now, shall we? Still don't like my statistics with that one. But, Luna can kill her. 5 HP. 2 HP. Good. I figured it out. I figured it out. I did the math. Alright, Kyoko. You got her. You got her. Get her. Yeah! She got her. The coin was flipped. Here, catch one of these. Oh, baby! Alright, it seems like there's four spirits left. Let's see. All of them can reach Komachi. Well, only two of them can, actually. And they have larges, which beats fast, so that's a little scarier than I want. So I'm just gonna move Komachi in general range, and I'm gonna keep, gonna keep what's going on here going on here. Chip damage with uh, with Suika, and then let Kogasa finish them off. That won't do enough. Take her down to four. Hmm. Uh, yeah, it's fine. It's alright, you're okay. You are strong. I guess I should finish you off, huh? Um, this'll do fine, yeah. Just regular blue homing. I think that's enough for those. I, I want to leave the rest of them for, uh, for Kogasa, really. Yeah, give me a fresh blue homing. Excellent. The fact that Vantage always works, no matter the HP score, is pretty fucking good. <laughs> so. Alright. I hope I miss. Man, you're too good. She was too strong for her own good. Oh my god. I think there's three left. Save every five turns. Okay. So there's four enemies left. 
Large, fast, precise. All right, okay. What do I want to do here? I kind of just want to leave it to Kogasa, since she's doing perfectly all right on her own. Yeah. Pretty much, yeah. Let's just do that. Leave it to Kogasa. Let me see if I can... I can probably aggro... I can aggro one of them over here. To, uh, try to fight Kyoko. And do that. So let's try that out. Um, yeah, that's fine. Doesn't hurt to take a shot. No, they can't really hurt Suika either, but I don't want Suika to steal the EXP, right? So I, I do want her to do chip damage, but I just needed to be careful. Um, uh, let's see. I'll give Yukari one more kill. If, uh, that fair- if that ghost comes down here, then I'll give her that to kill. Let's see what happens. Okay, Kogasa again. Vantage, free hit. All right. Another one. Very good. That one is hell bent on fighting Suika. It's fine. And that one also. Oh, okay. Nice. I I receive EXP do I doing the chip damage as well as getting more with uh Like, there really isn't any reason to not do this, I don't think. So let's just keep uh, chipping away at them, really. And get- I get a couple EXP, and when I finally kill them, I get a big, uh, a big layout. So, Kogasa might get two levels out of this, uh, decision. And I'm not really scared of the prison members leveling them up, because there's only those three left. Well, four left, and... Well, they're not leveling up themselves, so it doesn't matter. She will do it. Hell, if they actually increase in level, then I'll get more EXP by encounters. And they probably won't do that much more damage anyway, so I can just heal it off with a Volnary and call it a day. I just hope my weapon doesn't break. Hmm. We're at the halfway. Let's see. Um. Five, seven, thirteen. Okay. Just keep at it. Just keep at it. Here's the canon chat. Yoki is teaching Kogasa swordsmanship. So eventually, she's gonna be carrying more than an umbrella. You catch what I'm saying? All right, come here. Come, come hit the good morning crew. I know you want to. That did a lot. Okay, I think that's one down. Yep, that's one down. Juicy level up. Hmm. Uh-oh. <laughs> God damn it. You didn't need the 2% crit. Alright, let's see. Still can't kill Kogasa, so she's fine. Hmm. All right, and I guess, yeah, just end the turn. Advantage critical, it misses. Wait, do I die? Do I die if that hits me? All right. That was not part of the calculations at all. 
I'm not sure where I lost extra HP. Hmm. Well. Hmm. Ah, it doesn't matter. Let's do, uh... Blue large, blue large. Gyoko can't kill them at this range. That's not good. Um, the problem here really is that like I don't kind of want Kogasa to be alive for uh, well the EXP that comes from defeating these three. Uh... Yeah, no, I do. I do. I do want that. Those are three free level ups for whoever, uh, whoever kills the Prism Rivers. To be honest, the only thing that really happened during those turns anyway was Kogasa, you know, taking chip damage, so... Let's just put her back in position and get ready to attack. But let's try and alleviate some of the pressure, I suppose. Timeline abandoned. It's fine, we're just gonna do it all over again. And when I get low at HP, I'm gonna use a Volnary instead. So it's... Everything you see that's happening is probably gonna be the same RNG values, so I'll just be sure to heal this time and target a different opponent. Hmm. So fine, we have entered the no bully time zone. Nice. I don't like how much HP that one has. Alright. So, just keep hitting the one over here, I suppose. <clears throat> I don't know if it's a different or not. I My only experience with that information comes from playing Awakening and Fates, so I don't know if it's the same here. She'll be fine. She'll make it. Yep, that's three. It's okay. It's one down. Big level. All right. Well, RNG is different for level ups, but like, I mean for, uh, attacks and stuff. But that might just be because of, like, bookmarks or whatever. I'm not really sure, though. I wasn't paying attention. Did Kogasa get another kill or did Suika just axe that one? Okay, yeah, she axed that one. So RNG is clearly different because it's going infinitely better than it was up before. Oh. Currently have nine HP. So I could take I could take multiple attacks. We're fine. You're fine, Kogasa, you're fine. You can do it. You're the greatest. I believe in you. Here, come fight Kyoko. I know you wanna. Alright, that one's gone. Her strength increase is so bad, but her skill is so high. Alright, it's another one. That's a good level. I would have liked strength, but I cannot deny that's a good level. No, you fool! Alright, now we've entered the bone zone. Alright, let's see what happens. Nothing. Of course nothing happened. 
So, heal up Kogasa. So let's see what's going on up in La La Land here. Um. Hmm. So she has fast, she has homing, and she has large. So they're all different parts of the weapon triangle. So Kyoko would be better fit to fighting Lyrica. Kyoko needs a needs a friend. <laughs> Kyoko needs a friend to fight that. They're not gonna move from their spot, so this could be good. Um. Yeah, do it. Why not? Well, there. No audience members on the stage, please. Maybe they want to get on the concert. They're more than welcome to apply for a spot. The interview starts right now. Good luck with that, you two. You're part of this too. Lame. This is a healing tile, yes. This is a healing tile, but that's okay. Because Ron can approach, and then Ron can leave. <laughs> She's got a nice hat. I like her outfit a lot, actually. My job here is done. Farewell. All right, Kyoko. You can't do any damage. You have an 8% chance to hit. Yeah. All right. Um, Yukari or Yuko should be able to hit from range. <laughs> For zero damage. Excelente. Hmm. Do I have a very large? Uh, no, I don't. I do have magic, so there's that. So I can I can back up with magic at least. Yeah, I'll get my magic users in, in range. So, I'm hoping that they don't leave their spaces. They probably won't. So, let's just watch the magic, really. Yeah, I could give Kyoko the spirit larged. I'll give that- I'll, I'll make an exchange with, uh, Suika right now. No, I want to trade. I want you to take this. Uh, yeah, there you go. I guess I can give you some offensive help. Alright, show them the power of a good morning. Did I not give her the right one? She can't use it, she's not a high enough rank. Oh. Yeah, it needs to be rank D. I have an idea. Whoa, okay. Dude! I have an idea. I have an idea, chat. It's called getting that rank up. Alright, fairy, come here. Fire your, uh, fire your kill shot at her. Nice job. Alright. Fire your kill shot. Hmm. Ding. All right, retreat. And fight. It will take some time. It will take some time. But time is what I have. Uh, 
Hmm. Hmm. <clears throat> I do have the convoy, I just don't have access to uh, inventory, or like, management. I can't manage my uh, team ahead of time, which is kind of incredibly obnoxious. Uh, do I have an LR shot for her? No, I don't. Alright, buckle up, chat. It's gonna be a boring ride. Oh. Oh. I healed because Luna's in um, range. So I fired again. The damage. Kyoko runs in, screams into nothingness, and then runs away. <laughs> Hold on. I want to get Kyoko to rank D, I suppose. If Kyoko gets to rank D, she can actually use the spirit, and that'll probably be helpful. I don't even think I need Suika to be with her, uh, but I'm not really sure. I'm gonna move uh, Miyako here to get attacked. I know that sounds weird, but... I wanted to use up that last one. Hmm. Okay. Okay. So, can you finish the job, Kogasa? You just gotta hit her twice. There you go! You got one! Ow, I got hurt. I'll withdraw. I wonder if I helped. <laughs> Yoki siphoned some of that EXP. Red homing obtained. Alright. So now it's the plan. Merlin is now looking that way. It's on the turn, see what happens. Okay. So she'll attack there. Won't kill me. And then this will return fire. Won't do anything, but it will use up the rest of it at least. You do better over here. You can actually hurt her, but not by enough. She does not even drop the weapon she's using, so using her is for the best. Alright. Alright, jump in. I apologize, chat, but this is very convenient, and I kind of want to use Kyoko, so I want Kyoko to become strong. So this is what we're gonna do. This is the... This is the mission. Um... Oh, that's not pleasant number to look at. Alright, let's see. How do you fare in this matchup? You'll take some damage, but that's okay. What about green? Does green do damage? Of course it doesn't. Ah, uh, might as well. Hmm. This is perfectly fine. Alright, and I'm gonna... slot Ron in there real quick. Get a cheeky... Cheeky green homing, get some of her own stats up, and then run away. You know what the best part about uh, the beast ability is it's similar to how the cavalry units worked, but the cavalry units had issue going through terrain. Uh, Ron doesn't. Ron doesn't seem to give a shit about terrain. Come on, just hit her. Hit her and let it break, damn it. Nice. <laughs> How can you lose with that character? Oh. You think Yuko would be a better character if she put her hat back on? That might assist her a little bit. Oh. 
Every little bit helps. Alright, Kyoko. Your turn, little one. Get her! Um, let's see. I don't see myself using the Akadon like at all, but watch as she gets some of the nicest level ups possible. Oh my god. Alright. Kick her ass! Ding ding. I hope I'm getting EXP for that. I can't really tell. Hmm. I had 55. Let's see. Okay, I didn't actually get EXP for that. She switched to the, the weapon. Okay. But we're kind of... We're doing fine. What does red homing do? Powerful homing shot with lower accuracy. Oh, I see. So I can't use that, obviously. <laughs> Mario loses HP when he loses his hat in sunshine. That'll do 10 if it hits me. Oh, shit. Get her. Got it, finally. Jesus. That yeah, broke. Good. In Mario 64, I think you just take more damage when you get hit without your hat. And then in, my, in Sunshine, you lose damage over time. It's actually kind of funny because if you talk to a pi uh, Pianta while your hat is missing, uh, Mario still loses HP. So you can die in a cutscene, like while you're talking to them. And. Mario just won't respond like he just he's just standing there and they're talking to they're talking to him But he's knocked out and then as soon as you end the dialogue. It's like a uh, too bad Don't worry as soon as Kyoko gets access to uh To spirit we're gonna we're gonna do some actual damage here Get her thunder Great. Truly. Alright. Good. Alright, so she switched back to that. It's fine. Save the game again! How's progress going here exactly I don't see it going up hard to gauge it though isn't it maybe I actually have to do damage I don't think so though pretty sure I just have to hit her and then wait final season part one huh part one okay Green fast. The final season of the final season. Amazing. They're really just... They're really milking this shit, huh? Alright. Swoop in there and attack again. And then leave. <laughs> a painfully slow endeavor. Uh, you might hurt me. Alright, turn end. Ding. No damage. Ouch. Ding. No damage. I will beat her. I will. But before I beat her, Kyoko will be able to wield spirit magic. Keep it up. Keep it up. Good 
Very good. She's getting close, I think. It's like half, over half. Uh, let's see. It's, uh, looks, looks like it's going up. It's hard to really tell, though. <laughs> this is impossible! I'm withdrawing. Alright, I have sped it up a little bit. <laughs> nice, I think. That speeds up the process a little bit. Thunder. Uh oh. Nice dodge. I'm not sure what Komachi's class is, but oh ho ho. She seems to be like Suika, but you know, Suika's already established and Suika has tough skin, so Suika's unkillable. Ping. Oh, I dodged it. Nice. Green homing. Lyrica didn't even get to do anything. She was just, she was watching this, and Komachi walked up and took her out by surprise. Kind of a dick move, Komachi. Kind of a dick move. Oh, that wasn't enough to fully heal her. Which means I am now switching. You have 5 HP? What happened to these fairies, dude? Yeah. Yeah, whatever. Do the attack. Why not? See what happens. Ting. Nice. And you're fine there. And I want to put you back up here. And you're gonna... Ting, ting. Yeah, the peaches that Celestials eat increase their, uh, their physical durability. Alright, Kogasa's fast level has gone up. That's good. So she is, uh, she's resilient, is the best way I can say that. Kind of has to do with why people like to pin her as a masochist. Oh, a crit with nothing. <laughs> what a crit. Dude. Everything is A-OK. -okay. Ogasa still can't really hurt Merlin, but it's all right. And Kyoko is coming in. And Kyoko is gonna smack her with a green one. And then Kyoko is going to run away. And you were going to get patched up, put a band-aid on her. She's good to go, get her back in the ring. Meanwhile, Ron is going to effectively grind her, uh, her abilities here with this, uh, green homing. Ron's not leaving the team under un any under- and it under any circumstance, that's for sure. She's a little bit too good at this point. Recover friendship. Life comes at you fast. All right. Ding. 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 All right, very good. Hmm. Just keep doing it, really. Hmm. <laughs> 
He's just got them great night stats. Come on, Kyoko. I just want you to be able to use spirit magic so you can destroy Merlin in one hit. You're almost done. Couple more hits. Just a couple more and Kyoko will finally get a level. God damn, I'm getting excited. Nice. This is not what I expected today to be. But it's alright, because nothing bad is happening. Uh-oh. Wow. Every five turns. All right, Ron, do the damage and run away. This reminds me of early game bosses where they don't have ranged weapons, so you can just practice your archery on them. I actually did that in three houses. If you, uh, so you know how every character can use like a practice weapon, so it's really shit. But it's the only thing they can really use while their rank is E. Well, I gave everyone that could use a bow, a bow. Because you can still use broken items. But their accuracy, their hit rate is halved. So I just fired, fired arrows at the boss. With a uh, broken bows until everyone got like a rank, uh, a rank D or something with their, uh, their arrows. That, that battle took about 73 plus turns, I think. Something like that. It took a while. Because he wasn't moving. He wasn't moving. And he didn't have a ranged attack. So he just had to sit there and take... Be archery practice. What was he going to do? Complain? I had him. That was it. The game was over. Can I attack? I do two. pretty bad actually. I'm gonna move over here. Alright, Kyoko can now swing the big meme. That's fine. Okay. But I'll still give Kogasa the free hits for weapon proficiency. Hmm. Nice. Practice bows have better hit rates. Or practice weapons have better hit rates but lower attack. Um, yeah, her fast is at C, which is great. Alright, Kyoko, can you do it? 25 damage if this hits. I will do that. But first, give Ron a little more. Why not? I'm here already, right? Alright, move her out of the way. Alright, Kyoko, you can finish this right now. All you gotta do is hit the 41. You hit a 50, you can do it! Oh. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay, because she can just do it again. She has another try. Ding. She's gonna get some more proficiency grinding, that's all. Do you believe? Do you believe? No! Damn it! Okay, next turn. Uh, her LR is about to break. She has two hits left before that breaks.
Now she's back at full HP. Hmm. I can't beat her. She's too strong. Thank God for infinite attacks at Green Home. <laughs> Alright, now, the finale. Her weapon is now broken. Go. Oh, yo, go, come on. I don't think you can still use it, no, but she's stuck with having it equipped, which doesn't seem to have any penalties to it at all, so that's pretty cool. Ding, ding, ding. That red large should be mine. Hmm. Yeah, you could probably farm max proficiency here with the infidence. Because if her weapon breaks, she can't do anything, right? So, there's nothing really stopping you from doing that. Um, but, well, I don't want to be here for the next infinity to get proficiency that high. So, I'm okay with just ending this when I hit- Oh! I have a higher chance! I have a 2% higher chance of hitting her this time! It's all you need! And she rolled the double! Yeah! I've had a lot of fun. But I'm leaving for now. That's good. Magic. Magic is not a good level up. But the other stats are okay. I'll take it. That's a, that's a fantastic level up. Look at that. Take her spot, Kyoko. You earned it. Weak sauce. Ugh. Yeesh. How'd they ruin Merlin's groove? You girls aren't bad. You passed the interview with flying colors. You guys need to take responsibility for this severe buzzkill. That's right. We have too much pride to enter a concert on a note like this. Whoa, is it time? We doing it? Yep, it's time for a special encore. Wait, what? No! It's not over! Isn't that a trinity? Be careful, they seem to be playing to regularly swap out the vanguard. Oh my, oh my, consider my expectations exceeded. But spoilers, the employment interview is for you three. This is a problem. Damn. I'll do exactly one damage, which is just enough. Um, I wonder if that's a good idea though. Cause then I leave you I leave Yikari at the mercy of uh the the, the pair. Unless I put Yiko with her, I suppose. Yeah, there you go. That's one down. Ow, I got hurt. Alright, she went down again. I got a strength upgrade, too! Ouchies. We're done far! I can't believe they stopped us. Whew, they finally stopped playing. Oh, I only had to beat one of them! Well done. Oh, thank everything. I thought my sensitive ears were gonna fall right off. Ah, oh, Ron, your ears are so cute when you wiggle them like that. Hey, you can't just touch me whenever you want. I'm just going to ignore that. Now you three, what exactly are you plotting? Uh, plotting? We were just playing music. 
Yeah, yeah, we just wanted to get people pumped. And by that you mean turning ghosts into vengeful spirits and making a load of trouble for us, yeah? Turning ghosts into vengeful spirits? What? Don't tell me you didn't notice. We thought we were just injecting some hype into these ghosties, am I wrong? What is with her dialogue? I get ya. This is quite the predicament. Great music you guys play, but apparently great music ain't safe music. Okay, you three, listen up. Girls are now explaining. So that's what was happening. We thought the atmosphere was a bit strange, but... We were doing something awful like that. Sorry for real. Lunasa was all, let's pump up the netherworld, and wouldn't take no for an answer. What? Trying to dodge the blame, are you, Lyrica? Eh? No? What? Nothing of the sort! Ha ha ha! Yeesh. I guess we have no choice. It was fun, but we ought to stop playing here. It would be a big help if you did. There's one thing. That's one thing, but they must still pay back the damages they've caused. Crap. Is it time to bolt? Yukari, why don't I... Hm, I'll leave it to you. Eh, what's up? Hear me out. See, I really need to keep a better eye on the spirits around here. But as you can see, the world is vast, and its inhabitants many. Right. So here's what I'm thinking. Rather than punishment, how about some community service? You can help me govern this land. Govern this land? Hold on. Uh. Where? There. Your songs hold the power to influence spirits. I should think you'd be able to control their movements. Like conductors, perhaps? Hold on. Oop. Okay. But the ghosts who listen to our music went out of control. Certainly, your songs will need some fine tuning in that regard. As poltergeist, I think it should be possible for you. But what do you think? Hmm, I understand. In return for your forgiveness, we'll do our best to cooperate. Ah, this pleases me greatly. Had you refused, we'd have to resort to some truly ghastly measures. Personally, I'd rather not have to resort to such brutish methods, you know? So in that regard, you have my sincere gratitude. Yeah, thank goodness. <laughs> in any case, I look forward to working with you. She's having her way with them. Having her way with them? Really having her way with them, hmm. Man, how'd it come to this? Alright, I did it. It only took an hour and a half. But I did it. Chapter 5, the first yokai extermination. The eighth of the line of the Miyati. Aya Hieda. Her memories and records. Inherited from past generations in Gumonji, the power to remember her past lives. Yo, we're getting an Akyu! Well, not Akyu, but we're getting one of Akyu's, uh, one of the characters she descended from. For those who live in fear of yokai, she was born to be their hope. For their sake, Aya embarks on a mission of yokai extermination. Upon hearing news of this yokai subjugation squad, Yukari rushes to the scene. For to Yukari, the child of Miyari was, who was to be another critical component of her plans. Cave on the outskirts of the human village. Hey Yukari, we had stuff to do in this village, right? So why did we come all the way out here? Yeah, I thought we came here to eat all, all, all the delicious food. It doesn't seem like it'll all be that appetizing out here. Eat. Eat sound effect. You say that, but you still manage to find some fruit. Is something the matter? No, never mind. Lady Yukari, if I may, where exactly are we headed? It would appear we're about to enter a large cavern of sorts. And it feels like there's something peculiar about that cave. Well noted, Biakrodin. Your um, t intuition is on point. This cave has a hole straight to the underworld. Despite its plain appearance, it contains a path to a world completely unlike the surface. The underworld, huh? Of course, yokai living underground travel through here. Lately, it seems the number of yokai meddling with the human villagers has been increasing. Can I ask how exactly that ties in to our objectives here? There's no way you're about to say, protect the humans and exterminate the yokai. Got it in one. Seriously? Um, Gumonji, the power to retain generations of inherited records and memories and the one said to possess that power, the child of Miyati. For those that fear Yokai, she is a being of both great hope and great expectations. However, that goes for more than just humans. Her power, and indeed her life, are of critical importance to us. <laughs> you mean us specifically, right? Quite. The eighth child of Mi uh, Mi 
God damn it. Mare. Aya Hieda. It seems she's ventured into this cave for the purpose of yokai extermination. Our goal here is simple. We'll be protecting her. We're gonna exterminate yokai together with a freaking human? Um, yes, that is exactly right. <laughs> Yin or out? That said, there's no need to completely wipe them out. Our goal is to support and guard the child of Miyari. Protecting her is all I ask of you. For the time being, I'm afraid the two of you will just have to need to accept it. Actually, now that I think about it, I did hear, Seika, that there are quite a few talented yokai living underground. Maybe one of them will make for a fine test, chance to test your strength. Strong yokai, huh? Is that right? In that case, this might be kind of fun. Is that so? Perhaps I too will have something to look forward to. Are we all agreed? Then let us proceed. Just make sure not to mistake your means and our ends. Alright. Yes, of course, Lady Yukari. A human. A child of Miyare. I know it's connected to the underworld, but this really is deep, huh? I wonder how far it goes. It is way too gloomy in here. Stay here too long and you'll end up like Lunasa. Would you prefer it if I was as peppy as you are? Uh, no, I think you're fine just the way you are. Wait, chat, am I in the cave that's leading to the bridge? Does that mean this is the dark blowhole? I believe our destination is just up ahead. Well, it seems I was correct because that looks like a Satori. We finally cornered them. Your days of tormenting humans are finally over. Oh, it was Satori! I didn't expect you to come this far, but your journey ends here. You've already fallen into our trap. What? Everyone can come out now. Yep, there they are! There they are! Oh, there's a whole lot of them, isn't there? Impossible! We're completely surrounded! I bear no grudge with you or your people. However, for those that step into our sanctuary, there can be no mercy. Please prepare yourselves. This is too much! We need to escape! Running away. How bold of you. I let you slip away, but will the others? <laughs> Everyone, it's payback time! You really think we're just gonna let you go after after- Go after you torn up our place? Your fancy sur- You fancy surface dwellers with all your light making me so envious. Oh, she's grumpy looking. Resentment and hatred are overflowing. Oh, chat, her eye is open. No one can hold it in. Oh, she's going a little bit crazy. Nah. We have to escape somehow. Did you think we'd make it that easy for you? Bonk. Oh, dear ancestors, please protect me. Uh-oh. Oh, dear. Things are pretty lively down here. Everyone's all hopped up and raring to go. I'm sure to find one of them worth wrestling. If you need to fight, I don't mind, so long as we protect the child of Miyati. Understood. Time to play. First, we must make contact with Aya and demonstrate we mean her no harm. Yukari, I'll make sure to help too. Very well, one of us should talk to the child of Miyati. Uh, chat, the ghost... The ghost people are here. So I now have the ghost people. Uh, what do you have? Piggyback. When in the rear, will occasionally strike alongside the vanguard. Oh, that's a great support. And you only have ghosts, and you have only ghosts. Okay. This party is... Yeah, this party is huge. Do you see how big this fucking cave is? So, green fairy, icicle magic. Here's spider. Yamame. Immune to poison. Oh god. Toxic. Attack switch hit may poison enemies. And she has beast as well. So that's spider girl. Oh, this one. Underworld yokai. Scary lady. She has pass. Can move through enemies. Oh. Satori is there. Okay. And she has charisma. Allies are... Okay. And Nail Hill. Opponent's skills are disabled and cannot land critical hits. So oh, fuck off with that. 
she's got a... Wow. And then her, her sister is currently invisible, so I can't check her stuff. That's a healer ghost. Parsi. Okay. Her only growths really are speed and HP. That's interesting. She has confusion. Attacks may confuse enemies. Whatever that means. And then Bukit. Awful growth. <laughs> That's an armor unit if I've ever seen one. Faint. Attacks may hit, uh, hit stun enemies. Okay. There is a lot going on down here. Charge. Rarely after combat. Start another round of combat. Okay. Monk. And I, uh... Okay. Prayer. Occasionally dodges killing blows. Alright. A guide to yokai skill plus two. I see. So one of my units needs to reach her, basically. Hmm. Alright. Game time. Six damage... Versus... I'll go for the double, yeah, why not? Alright, let's do it! Yeah, it has to be one of the main characters, I know. But yo, I can't pick my positions, so... Where they are is where they are. I guess I can just send, start sending some down here. They're homing in large. Yeah, homing in large for the most part. Hmm. No, they should they should be running away. They, I know they're green units, but I would assume they're attempting to flee, considering how the it started. But well, I could be wrong. Hey, let's get Yukari in position or Yuko in position here. We'll block any uh, assaults for the moment. Mm. Okay. And get Ron down here to block this one as well. And just bully the fairies, really. Hmm. Maybe the resub Lazara? Just one more second, UFO. Three minutes, baby. Three minutes. Let's see. So I guess I'll just start moving them both up here, huh? Alright. So, large is good. Large is beneficial down here, so... I'm gonna put Komachi with, uh... With Kyoko, and I'm gonna move Kyoko down here. Okay, and I'm going to have, let's see, there's a lot of enemies up there, less so down here, but it all kind of loops, so I'll send more, I'll send Suika up, I suppose, and then Trinity Factor, I'm going to send Trinity down here. Akradin. Uh, question is, what what do I do with the Prism Rivers? Because they're all level, they're actually, they're accurate levels. Can they Trinity? I assume they can Trinity. Hmm. Yep. They can, in fact, Trinity. So... That's fine like that. NPC turn. Okay, they're running away. What the hell are you thinking? <laughs> I can't help her. What are you doing? You're stealing my kill! 
Get the fuck out of here. Stole my kill. Well done, Ron. Well, that's scary. They suck. Hmm. You're dead. I, I, there's nothing I could have done about that. Dude, there's so many. You came down here acting like you own the place. What kind of host would we be if we didn't show you how terrifying we can be? Drink your fill of our power, you call abominable. Ah, what is this? A poison. They left their guards wide open. Best watch your heads! Huh? What was that? Oh, they're showing off the status ailments. I'm done being patient. Let's grow envious of everything together. Huh? There's a green light flickering. Okay. Everyone, what's the matter? Please get a hold of yourselves. You're poisoned. You're stunned. And you're confused. What is this? Oh, I know. I should consult the Genso Chronicles. A Tsuchigumo, a Tsurubi Otoshi, and the power of Hashihime. Lydia, please save me. Hold on a second. I'll do something. Uh, abnormalities born from the power of Yokai. I see us. Access some charms work. Here, take this. There you go. Hmm? Lady Aya, what are you safe? Just now, I think something hit my head. Why is she always the one... Huh? What am I talking about? It worked, just as the Gensokyo Chronicles described. The memories and records of my ancestors were correct. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was unexpected. Lady Hiata. <laughs> what even happened? Lady Hiata, did you make it another miracle for us? So that's it. Ah, Lady Hiata, you really are our savior. Everyone, so long as we have the Gensokyo Chronicle, we didn't fear the power of Yokai. We're gonna get out of this together. Yeah! Praise be our child of Miyade. <laughs> ah, dear ancestors, thank you. Thank you so much. I am so grateful to have such wonderful ancestors. Praise be! Praise be to the child of Miyade. Praise be. Do you wish to learn about status effects? Teach me, Daisei. It's been such a long time. Daisei's here with another tutorial. Looks like everyone's getting pretty heated up. Yokai and the Gensokyo Chronicles are both so powerful, so this time we'll be explaining how to deal with status conditions. <clears throat> now let's begin. Firstly, there are the following types of status conditions. Poison that gradually lowers HP, Faint makes it impossible to take any actions for a time, and Berserk which causes the unit to move independently and strangely. You may gain a status condition when attacked by foes with certain skills, or when taking damage from certain shots with status conditions. Almost all status conditions will heal naturally over time, though it will take a while. However, it's best to cure them as soon as possible. That's where the exorcism charm comes in handy. With this, you can instantly recover from a status ailment. You'll be able to return to battle immediately. There are other status ailments in addition to the three listed above, but you can rest assured that the exorcism cram will cure these too. So don't worry. Status ailments are seriously annoying. They sure are! I'm glad you put them in the game! But when you get one, don't just gnash your teeth. Handle it with skill. I want to have a page in the Gensokyo Chronicle 2. Oh. I'm afraid that won't be happening. Okay, time. How did you get behind me? What the fuck? How'd you do that? Oh, you pass. Alright. Get up here. Switch. And attack. 11 times 2. Yeah, why not? Oh, baby, a critical! Okay. Now. You have large. I have fast. You kill me. You don't, though. Blue fast, green fast. Blue fast. 
Hmm. I cannot do anything to stop them. Dang. Alright, you you go finish finish that fairy. Nice. I said no to the first tutorial when I had to replay it and it worked fine, and then I said no to the second tutorial and I got a tutorial anyway. I was like what? <laughs> um you can actually do some damage if you hit me. But you won't hit me, because my, I am Ron. You cannot hit me. Oosh. Go ahead, try. Impossible! How did that hit me? Well, whatever. Let's see if I can protect that monk. Wait a minute, did Yuko miss? No, she didn't. That's a different fairy. Well, this is interesting, isn't it? How much does uh, Kyoko do? Just five. Okay. This does nine. That does nine. That does 17. Leaves us six HP. How much do you do? 14 with a pretty guaranteed chance to hit me, huh? Yeah. Yes, you do. Okay. Seven. Alright. 14. Still gonna do five. Eight plus five. Is enough damage. Okay. Do your job! Now wait. Alright. Please no. Don't take my kill again. Uh oh. Faint, no counter. Okay, good thing it missed. You're dead. The bucket has arrived. She's moving. At least they're kind of staying put for now, but I need to get through this initial, like, wave. Alright. A crit there would have been fantastic. Alright, that's fine. Uh, I can heal or I can attack. I'll do eight. And this won't. It'll do six, but pretty much guaranteed to get hit. And I'm dead if it does hit me. That does 13. And that's ranged. So the red does 13. He'll kill go up. Sure. Why not? Nope, they don't get much EXP for that. Now, I can still attack her, but I'd rather she... I'd rather she attack me first, so... Instigate the fight. 
So, let's see. They're gonna keep running until it's safe. And now, Kasume is involved. Hey, child of me out of I hear it, yes? What? How'd you sneak up on me like that? Be at ease, I bear you no harm. Rather, I've come to help you. Help? Uh, why? Aren't you a yokai? Whether you trust me or not is up to you. But, uh, let's just say that we need you, and I'll leave it at that. I'm not sure I follow, but I'll put that aside for now. Anyway, let's get out of here now. I'm glad you're so sensible. Let's go. Can I control the monks now? Of course I can't, but I can control her. So what can she do? Oh, she doesn't attack. She doesn't have an item to attack with. She uses magic. But she's a... Oh, she uses homing, but it's terrible. So she's basically just a... Just a heal bot. She's gonna get hit there. needs to work. Please work. Good. Uh, whatever. And there we go. That should be enough to take you out. Bye-bye. Ron. One damage. Six damage. Okay. <laughs> Kasume can be taken out, at least. And I'll put... You know what? I'm actually perfectly okay with Ron's position, but I'll move her back one, just in case. And recovery charm. Put the gossip back up the phone. Okay. Why are you moving? What are you doing? I can't be held responsible for this. They're getting closer. Green units! Why did that one have damage done to it? Oh right, I got attacked by that other... The monk that died. Okay. So... Can I can I finish this job a little more comfortably? Six damage. Six damage. Okay, that's good. And hit her with the green. There we go. Give me strength. Nice. Nice. I can get behind that level up. There's not much else going on over here, huh? That's all right. Keep going on so front for now. Okay, <sighs> think time. Time to big think. Did you use a Volnair or something? You did. So, your... Your damage is a bit annoying. Spirit homing, blue homing. Let's go for it. A crit would be nice, because it would do 15. That was 17% chance! I fucking love RNG. Hey, what can Kogasa do to her? Kogasa gets a double with nothing. 
No, Kogasa literally can't do any damage to her. Okay. Neither can you. Okay. 17% chance to hit me, though. Like, really? Okay. Move her out of the way. And seek, uh, smacker. This fight would have been over. Oh, you dodged that one, huh? Okay. And fire at this one. I sent all my magic users to the other side of the map. What a surprise! The monk is in my fucking way. I don't really want to fight Parsi. Parsi reach. Parsi can't reach. Okay. Alright, well, that's a bit annoying. Let's just end the turn. No counter. Well, clearly, because I'm concussed. Usually you get rewards for letting the green units survive, but like, I can't really protect them when they throw themselves in danger like that. That didn't do anything. Yeah, give me the save. Okay. Still can't move? Nope. Can Ron finish this? Yes, she can. No problem at all. Concussive bucket. Goodbye. Yeah. magic seal does and then beast to move again we're kind of coming on all sides here the problem at the moment is that I can't really stop this assault because the monks have decided that they're the greatest units in the game and they don't need my help. Hmm. You're a healer, so... Here, catch this. Oh my god, dude. Everything good? Probably not. Would you like to come fight me? I will wait. Alright, now, 
Oh, nice. They moved. Okay, they moved to protect her. They're still definitely going to die, though. 17% chance to get hit. Unbelievable. Alright. Almost just got killed by a fairy. And that's the end of the game. Okay. So that wasn't a very good turn. And the game crashed. Yes. Yes. Uh, I'm done. I don't want to play anymore. That's uh, a bit frustrating. And I don't really want to do anything again. So I'll try again next time. And I have the five turn save. And if that doesn't work out, I can just redo the chapter. But wow, that's, uh, that's a bit rough. Wasn't much I can really do about that one. But it is what it is. 17% chance. Man, I got hit by a 17% chance. And it ruined my best unit. Oh, well. I'll try again next time.